Today, there seems to be some sort of misunderstanding. How much farther to camp, sir? About an hour, Marcy. Sir, the kid behind me called me a name. Tell him to shut up or I'll crack his binding and dim his outlook. You have a colorful way of talking, sir. He did it again, sir. Point him out to me when we get to camp, Marcy, and I'll shorten his lifespan. That's okay, sir. I already hit him. Maybe he's hurt. Do you have a first aid kit? That's what I hit him with. This camp chow is good. Aren't you gonna eat, Marcy? That same kid has been calling me names again, sir. I can't eat. He upset you so much you can't eat? No, I hit him with my lunch. Marcy, listen. Something's scratching outside our cabin. I think it's that kid who's been calling me names, sir. Really? Well, if he tries to scratch his way in here, I'll break all his arms. He's not scratching to get in here, sir. I pushed him into the poison oak. that you don't like that kid calling you names. But if you don't calm down a bit, you might end up killing him and get kicked out of camp. For starters, you hit him in the bus, then clobbered him with a lunch tray, then pushed him under the lake. Have you noticed, sir, that he hasn't called me a name all day? Stop calling me, sir. Where is he now? He went to see the nurse. He's leaving the nurse's office, sir, and you'll finally hear the names he's been calling me. You just listen. He's right behind me, sir. Stop calling me, sir. Psst. Hi, lamb cake. Hi! Marcy, you can't slug somebody for calling you lamb cake. What about noodle neck or clement head? People call each other lots of strange things without being really serious. See ya, Noodle Neck. What happened? Where am I? Sorry, kid. My friend there doesn't understand. I like your friend. I think she's cute, sir. Don't call me sir! You two. You haven't stopped picking fights since camp started. I was positive he was going to insult me again, sir. It wasn't an insult. I don't know her name, so I called her Lamb Cake. I just wanted to get acquainted with her. I think she's cute. He thinks you're cute, Marcy. Pound him, sir. He's just being sarcastic. Stop calling me, sir. I'm not sure you can pound someone just because he calls you a lamb cake. That's sarcasm, sir. If someone calls you lamb cake when you know you're not a lamb cake, that's sarcasm. Was I wrong to call your friend lamb cake, sir? No, but you're wrong to call me sir. I think she's beautiful. I think I'm in love with her. What's your name, kid? Floyd, sir. Well, Floyd, love can be kind of painful.
for my group. I'm heading home. Bye, Patty. Good luck with everything. Goodbye, my little lamb cake. Floyd, seriously, it's really not nice to call Marcy your lamb cake just when you say goodbye for forever. I don't want it to be forever. I want to see her again. I like her. I think she's beautiful. That's pretty cute. What do you say to that, Marcy? Punch him in the nose, sir. I'm sure he's being sarcastic. May I take your picture, lamb cake? Better yet, let's have one taken of us like this with our arms around each other. How about another one, Floyd, to show the insurance company? Will it be okay if I at least write to you? You can write all you want, but I won't answer. I don't know your last name. I don't know your address. You're weird, Marcy. Floyd seems like a nice kid, Marcy, and he really likes you. I've never owned a dog or a cat or a horse or a hamster or anything, sir. I'm sure not ready for a boyfriend. You're weird, Marcy. Everything in its time. Good night, sir. <laughs> <laughs> 